Alright, got some lunch going, and now let's head into Ninja Turtles land? I don't know what this is. Anyway, uh, hey everyone, uh, Tapper's here again, and welcome back to the Sonic 2 Long Play Edition, where we are now in Genocide City, one, uh, I think the third scrapped level that we've come across, and the third of the, uh, what's it called, um, two-player musics. This time we have the uh, Carnival Night Zone, or Carnival Night? Casino Night Zone two-player music, and uh, I actually like this one. I don't know why exactly, but it, it's actually kind of cool. And also we have a ton of, uh, oh, I thought that was a pit. Uh, was it uh, chemical plant uh, enemies with the spiders, which you probably only saw one time, and also, is that a monkey head? Or is that supposed to be Robotnik's glowing eyes? Because I'm not really sure. But, uh, Genocide City Zone, um, you can probably make one guess as far as why it's a scrapped level. Also, uh, it's apparently a water level because it's supposed, it's supposed to be kind of like a sewer sort of area. And I'm still under speed shoes. That's kind of awkward, especially when you consider... Okay. I got through, and... Yeah, that was actually a very quick stage, and uh, apparently this was supposed to be... Yeah, the obvious reason this was probably scrapped is because um, 1992 Genesis game, pe kids wanting to play uh, Sonic something fast like this, and is this what I think? Oh yeah, so... Yeah, obviously you don't want to have anything named Genocide in the game, sort of like how you... I mean, gambling's okay, or at least it was okay, and... So, I actually read something about... Um... Hey, buddy. You okay? You can come out. It's safe. Those badniks will leave you alone. But I, uh, actually read on the Sonic Retro site, because that's kind of where I was, like, finding out some of this information. Uh, this is supposed to resemble... Um, well, that resembles an eye up there. Uh, and in case you aren't noticing right now, um, this is actually repeating the, uh, first zone again. Because I guess they didn't have a design in specific as far as, like, replicating the stages, or maybe these were in the actual beta copy or something, but, um, yeah, we're already kind of done. I'm barely even three minutes in this video, but I never really talked about it. But it kind of gives this Ninja Turtles sort of feel with the sewers, the city, uh, that eye up there. Don't worry about it. It's fine. Oh. So I I do know that this is supposed to be the uh, chemical plant boss, but I didn't remember there being two pits when I saw this video. That is supremely awkward. I'm pretty sure I was looking the other way. And I feel like I should not have gotten hit by that, but... And I'll take this the long way. Okay. Don't fall. Okay. <laughs> yeah, so far all my deaths are against the, uh the remake bosses, or uh, the recycled bosses, I should say, and this is like four minute video so far, and I didn't even get to really talk about this, but there's like a SNES game that rips this sort of design from, I it's like Shiro or something like that, I don't know what it is, if it's like a Shinobi type of game, or Ninja Gaiden sort of, it's like, the name just does not sound familiar at all, and I wouldn't be surprised if it's specifically just Japan only, but that doesn't matter because we're now heading into Hidden Palace Zone, the other, the most notable scrapped level, and it's actually, I think, in a re-released version on, like, maybe a collection or something. I don't really remember. Music's kind of mystic in a way, along with... Uh, what was that? Is that Bat? What was that? 
But I, I think as far as like this zone, it's kind of like you can see a, there's a lot of green, sort of like some shine. Oh, there's a bat. Okay. Why was there just a a slide like that? It's kind of awkward. When did I get a hundred coins? That's kind of odd. Also, kind of a very awkward double kill. Okay, very nice. But, yeah, the Master Emerald! Oh, it's a fake. Sort of like the fake heart heart piece candy. I've been watching too much of Zeal lately, or Zexel, or whatever. Wait, there's water here? I don't remember this. At least... Okay, admittedly I saw Brain Scratch doing, like, the Lost Levels or Lost Worlds. And they were doing some, there was like fan versions of scrap levels and not exactly my lives. How could you do this to me? Did, I didn't, okay, I didn't go this way. All right. Oh, no, wait, I have. Oh, crap. It's a maze again. And there's that, there's the bat that I was looking for. Oh. I forgot about that. Oh, no wonder that platform broke. That's why I couldn't find it. And... Did those badniks just respawn? I feel like they have. This is Mega Man X3. Where all of them just respawn? Oh, that was kind of weird. Yep, that's normal. Okay, fine, I'll go down this way. Actually, wait, I didn't... I thought I went that way. No, no, I, d I broke a Master Emerald somewhere else. That's right. Uh... Does this make a leap of faith? Oh, no, the platform was just right there. Okay. And I got another one up. Nice. Okay, that was a nice speed section. Didn't like the fact that I had to kind of figure out where I was going again, but I think it's a lot less extreme than uh, Rock Desert, Desert Rock, Rock Desert, and Lost Wood Zone, that's right. Also, the starting point of this zone is kind of unusual. Now, as far as like why this one was kept, I think maybe the developers decided to eventually put this back in for later versions, or at least re-releases, or some form. I, I can't remember what version it was that decided... Those bumps are kind of weird. Uh, are there any Chop Chops? Yeah, those are those Piranha Blue enemies that you kind of saw in... Uh, what was it? Aquatic Rune Zone? Hmm. I like moving forward with no air bubbles. Oh, good. I can get out. <laughs> God, it feels weird that there's actually water here, because I, I know the version I saw had nothing as far as underwater. In fact, the badniks here are kind of different, because I don't remember those dinosaur-looking ones. Also, is this a repeat? Because I remember... Okay, it was shifting for some reason. I thought I was at the boss, which I think is supposed to be the Mystic Cave boss played over again and with no real changes. What? Oh. Yeah, there it is. And, ugh, those sprites kind of look ugly. Actually thinking about it, the uh, Mystic Cave in the Lost Worlds, I think just didn't even have stuff raining down, and it just kind of looked lazy or something. Ow. Yeah, I think... Oh, yeah, now I remember. The uh, Hidden Palace actually had a different boss, which kind of looked like a trom 
bone machine or something? I have no clue what it was, but it was very unusual to see, because, I mean, there was some creativity there, and it's just unfortunate we didn't get to see it back in the day. And now, the level back in the day that haunts many, many people. But we will get to that in a moment. Metropolis Zone, it's going to be a marathon, or maybe it won't, because I'll have some stuff to talk about, I hope. Uh, see you in a moment. <laughs> 